Hi, welcome to another Cyber Short. My name is Patrick Milford. I'm a Detective Superintendent at the South East Cyber Resilience Centre. And also joining me today is... Hi, it's Chris White, Head of Cyber and Innovation in the South East Centre. And today we're going to discuss uh, security awareness training and why it's really important for companies to invest in their staff. So first one, Chris, what is security awareness training? So security awareness training provides employees with an effective understanding of their cyber environment and gives them the confidence to recognise and draw attention to any potential security issues. The topics we cover include recognising social engineering, we cover all the different types of phishing attacks, the importance of using strong passwords, managing social media accounts and recognising a cyber attack and handling a ransomware event that follows. So why is it so important to train your staff, Chris? We all staff are the first and last line of defence. They prevent breaches, they reduce the impact of an attack if it happens, but ultimately they protect your data reputation and your bottom line. So training should include individuals from all roles within the organisation, from the finance teams all the way to the leadership teams. How often should you train your staff? Well, the Information Commissioner's Office recommends that all new staff should receive training before accessing corporate data, ideally within one month of their start date as well. Staff should undergo refresher training, typically annually, but it shouldn't exceed two years. And there should be monitoring process in place that just track completion rates and attendance and then just have the ability to follow up on those that missed out. Okay, Chris, so what is security awareness training delivered by the Cyber Resilience Centres? Kind of how long does it last? Is it online or in person? What's the cost of it? Those sort of things. So our training typically lasts two and a half hours, but the timing can be flexible depending on whether or not you want shorter or longer sessions. But two and a half hours is the guide time. The trainers we use are highly knowledgeable in this area. They're personal and they like to create an environment where all the staff feel comfortable and have the ability to ask questions. The two options, we can do it online using Microsoft Teams, or we can come to your premises and do a face-to-face in-person event. We tailor the training according to your organisation based on your size and the sector that you work in. We have online events, three or four a month at the moment. And don't forget, the best bit of all, training is fully funded for all our members and membership is also free. To access that, all you've got to do is join one of your local cyber resilience centres. That's brilliant. Look, Chris, thanks so much for your time. Uh, Really useful bit of information there, so thank you.